everyone, uh, this is uh, Jonah Anderson and today is Saturday, uh, the 20th of January 2024. I am in my uh, home office, in my corner office, and I'm on my computer uh, talking to you on my camera to record this. And I wanted to take the opportunities to greet you, of course, a happy weekend and to share some updates of what I've been up to lately. So this week I was in the micro, uh, uh, European uh, MCT or Microsoft Certified uh, Trainers uh, Summit in the Netherlands. So I did really learn a lot from being there and meeting the trainers community. So it was awesome. Learned a lot different ways. I hope I could uh, put it into details maybe on a blog or another video, but it was awesome. And then I got back to work uh, um, uh, when I got back from the Netherlands. And uh, today, uh, now it's weekend, it's actually my days off. I'm spending time with community work and some, some uh, learning myself as well, of course, taking it easy. <laughs> so um, I did record a new podcast with Shetty and I will be preparing also to finalize uh, or re-record my session for the 90 days of DevOps. It's actually done, but I want to make it better, the presentation. I did record only once, but it could be better. And uh, Aside from that, uh, recording the 90 Days of DevOps, to those who don't know. So 90 Days of DevOps is an initiative by Michael Cade, where everyone in the community that wants to learn DevOps can spend their time, do open source learning together, and learn with the community and those speakers that volunteer to speak. It's actually a yearly event. And uh, it started at the beginning of the year uh, until 90 days. And my session is on the 66th date. So uh, I'm preparing for, uh, preparing for it, uh, not uh, actually finalize in a way that I want to, uh, to re-record my session, but uh, it, is, um, it is on the way. I am also uh, sharing that next, week we will be having a new session in Azure User Group Sweden where we will be having uh, a guest speaker, uh, Thomas, who will be uh, sharing with us how to uh, use Azure Arc uh, Bridge um, with the Azure um, Stock HCI. So it's a, it's a field that I'm not really so familiar uh, the Azure Stack SEI, so it's good to learn it uh, from our guest speaker, and it would be great to host that uh, as well. And one last reason why I'm recording this is that I want to announce the winner of the best technical question on our last session. So last weekend, uh, we had uh, a new Microsoft MVP, Nicholas Chang, from the UK, who uh, joined us and shared his knowledge about automating Azure application gateway certificate using Azure Key Vault and Acme Boot. So it was an interesting session. Um, and there were community members that really asked uh, some interesting questions as well, uh, who joined us. And uh, we decided to choose one of the uh, community members that joined and asked questions. and. Uh, I want to congratulate uh, Rahul Abor. Uh, thank you for asking questions uh, during the session. So you are the winner of the ebook giveaway, and the ebook is, of course, my book, Learning Microsoft Azure Cloud Computing and Development Fundamentals. So feel free to like comment. On this post when I post this video or send me uh, a DM direct message uh, and share your email address about uh, where I can send uh, the ebook to you so congratulations and those that wants a copy a, comp a copy of my book or a giveaway 
feel free to uh, engage yourself and interact on our upcoming sessions at Azure User Group Sweden. I'm actually giving away. We're going to have some uh, giveaways here and there, um, depending on the topic, of course. But uh, we do have that. Uh, and I, since I'm the author, I have the freedom to do that. So uh, feel free to uh, join us and share with your friends if you're interested in Azure related topics, community learning. Azure User Group Sweden, invite your friends. If you want to be a speaker, regardless if you're a new expert speaker, you are welcome to share your knowledge with us. And to those that have submitted our sessions, I know we've been very slow in accepting your sessions. It's because we do have a schedule that we follow and we do have a queue of sessions that we're about to expect uh, to accept as well. So we don't want to turn down everyone. We want to give everyone the opportunity to speak. It may take time, but we're, uh, we're scheduling as, uh, as we go. And I hope that you're patient, uh, patient with it. Uh, one day you will have a chance to speak in our group. But uh, thank you so much for all your support. And I wish everyone a happy uh, weekend. So have a great day and have a good one. Bye.